you guys, celebrity closet connoisseur, Lisa Adams. Welcome. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I was already getting her to do my closet one day because I was like, I need help. But I, I, loved, I love this time of year because we get to travel, we get to see family, we get to mm -hmm. see friends, but it's also very scary to be able to do different things. So yeah. first of all, I want to talk about you. Okay. I love your closets. You just recently did <laughs> Khloe Kardashian's closet. I did. That must have been closet. fun. It was, was that fun? fun. It was fun. Look at that. It's like a store. I mean, it's amazing. <laughs> Let's see who else closets you did. Ooh. So that's so Juliana Mancic, right? Juliana's Juliana on the left, and we've got Whitney Port. So basically, everybody's closet looks like a store. That's it's the idea. Kind is that of everything amazing. has its place. <laughs> I love it. And you know, the whole thing about closets is it's about organization. It is. And I think when we talk about traveling and packing, mm -hmm. that's really organization, but like, really like put it down. <laughs> Condense. Yeah, yeah, and it's even harder. It I is. Think, in a way, I mean, I think even in a closet, I mean, it, I think the, the problem is that you're over cluttered, you're overstuffed. And yeah. I think the idea for packing is that you get as efficient as possible. And I agree it feels with you. Good. And since we can't bring a store with us, yeah. and a lot of us <laughs> overpack and I, uh, me included, you know, I figured out what a really good tip is. So I want to start with step one. We decide what we're packing yep. before we can pack. So while we're going through our closets all the time, we're thinking, well, what are we going to bring? And I really figured out that there is a simple rule to everything. So number one, bring one coat only. Mm -hmm. And I always say bring a coat that you can actually dress up or dress down. So I always love a trench because that's sort of occasion free. Yep. So it can be casual casual or it can be dressy. Mm -hmm. And of course, wear your bulky items right onto the plane so that you can have much more room in your suitcase for mm -hmm. other things. And then of course, my favorite thing is also to mix in some jersey because yeah, this is the number it. one thing. And people don't realize that you can wear a jersey dress, but it all rolls up and it's wrinkle free because the last thing you want to do is to be able to shake things out and have to iron it when you're on, on vacation. I agree. Accessories I love because it's a one way they can change up a lot of mm -hmm. different uh, looks within your closet and within what you pack into something different. And of course, bring one pair of dressy shoes. And I love ballet flats. Can I please show you guys this for one minute? Ballet flats are the perfect everyday casual shoe and it folds and look at this. And I took a hair tie because everyone has this. And you can literally do that and stick it in your uh, suitcase yep. to go. And you know what? These were under 10 bucks amazing. at Ross. Isn't that amazing? Amazing. So, all this here is 10 pieces from your closet. Mm -hmm. And within 10 pieces, I created 28 outfits. So you could literally go away for an entire month and wear something different every single every day. Time. I mean, it's kind of awesome, don't yeah. you think? Yeah, I mean, it's all about the art of repurposing. And, it is. Yeah. Okay, so once we have what we are packing, mm -hmm. how do we pack it? <laughs> well, the secret is organization and everything having a spot. So I designed this carry-on suitcase. It's the LA Mobile Closet. And it basically, it, it's a spot for everything. So you've got shoes, you've got compartments for toiletries, for your curling iron, it's heat tempered, but basically all in one. And so that's, that's the idea. And I realize not everybody can have their own mobile closet, but you can create your own mobile closet. So we can basically do it with any piece of luggage we, we, we have in our closet. Okay. And, so what are some of the tips you have for us to be able to create this level of organization in our luggage? So as you can see, it's, it's really about compartments. So okay. you can fit two pairs of shoes, underwear, socks. It's very, so you don't, you, you don't overpack. And I think that's the idea here where you've got compartments. So this is your pouch, this is your compartment. And so you can't overpack. You can only fit whatever you've got okay. in here. So everything stays very organized. You've got a place for everything. And I love sandwich bags. I use that for everything because you can put also like dirty laundry. It's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> but wait, you actually have, and we talk about this all the time, the rolling. And we, we, yeah. I roll all my clothes in, this, in my suitcase as well. Mm -hmm. But you actually have a special way of rolling. You call it something special too. I love it. The burrito. So yes. I think everybody knows about rolling, but this is the art of the burrito. Okay, I want to so see let me this. Show this you. is amazing. So so you basically tuck under like that, fold like you would do a regular t-shirt. So it goes like that. Then what you want to do is roll from the top. So just like that, like a burrito, wrap this underneath. Burrito. Look at that. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. And I have to tell you, so, and then with socks and with t-shirts, mm -hmm. I also do what I call the sushi. <laughs> I do like our entire Love suitcase is, is an it's entire eating. meal. But you just basically roll everything up. And you know, once you have it, you can also, if you have t-shirts, you can actually um, put it in your suitcase yeah. this way. But I love it also being able to use it to stuff these rolled up socks into your okay. shoes. Because number mm -hmm. one, it keeps your shoes, it keeps your shoes shape uh -huh. so it doesn't collapse when it's in your suitcase. And then you have a tip of actually putting it in a shower cap. Yeah, so I mean, you can get a shower cap at every hotel that you stay at. And it's just nice. It's sanitary. It keeps the dirt off your shoes from getting in on your clothes. And then the heels don't puncture the other clothes in your, in yeah. your suitcase. So it actually does multiple things at the same time, but be able to help you be organized yeah. and clean at the same time. Oh my God. 